Hey guys, what's up? Neostar here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create and remove an account using only CMD. For Windows XP users, sometimes command prompt can be blocked by the admin. So if you want to find a way of still managing to get this up, then all you need to do is go into Notepad, type in command.com, and then save it as a batch file. You can do this by Save As. Save it to the desktop or wherever you want to save it. And then call it whatever you want. But make sure you add .bat because that will save it as a batch file and allow you to run it. I don't need to do this as I'm not on XP, I'm on Windows 7. On Windows 7, all you need to do is type in command and you need admin approval for this or you need to run it as the administrator whereas XP you don't have to do that as long as you have access to CMD on Windows XP you'll be able to do all of this so for Windows 7 you have to run it as the administrator and it will ask for confirmation obviously click yes okay now we get to adding and removing an account first off to show you the accounts that I have on my computer, I'm going to type in net user. As you can see, I only have three accounts, which is the admin, myself, and the guest. Next off, I'm going to be showing you how to add an account. So type in net user, followed by a space and the name of the account that you want to add. So I'm going to use Steve as an example. Then I'm going to do another space followed by Steve's password which is going to be 123456 after this do another space forward slash whoops, forward slash add as you can see the command has been completed just to prove that the account has been added I'm going to type in net user again and as you can see Steve's joined us hello Steve ok now to remove an account you pretty much follow the exact same steps as adding it so type in net user space steve forward slash delete this will delete the account as you can see it's completed so just to prove it to you I'm going to type in net user again and there you have it Steve is no longer with us I hope this was a helpful tutorial for you guys out there especially you guys on Windows XP if you're doing this on a school computer which is blocked although I don't advise it Please rate, like and subscribe to me as it would help me out a lot. Thank you all for watching. See you guys later.